Oh! Oh, hey, look at that! The mic was on. It was on the whole time. <sighs> door to door. Controller get in under 20 minutes. 25 minutes. That's how you do it. That's impressive. I don't care who you are. Hmm. Did so quick, our beer's still cold. Look at that. Now that is something. Let me tell you, I may have ran a little bit. I'm not lying. I may have done a little job. May have ran all the way to Japan. Get this straight from my friend Shigeru Miyamoto. I'm not lying. Boosh. Right there. I'm actually like really surprised how fast that Of course now, Nintendo. Fuck Nintendo. Gotta put those little little plasticky. Ooh. Satisfying sound I ripped that off, huh? Okay. Yeah, so who's still here? Anybody left? Chris? Stuart? Anybody? Salty Seahorse? I don't even know if Salty Seahorse is a real person. If you are a Salty Seahorse, say the things. Okay, so, oh, with that, pull this guy out. Wow, they do some real serious packaging with this. Nintendo. So you are what? Oh, you are USB Type C. Oh, get out! I thought she'd be like mini USB. Oh, styrofoam! Styrofoam! Any styrofoam pro pro pros prospects? Products? Any styrofoam products are the worst. Like this isn't even like super. Like this is just a styrene wrapper, but it has the worst sound in the world. It's just absolutely the worst. All right, let's see. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Peel. The sound of the peel. Oh, perfect. So this is... Oh, this feels so much better. Oh my god, this controller feels incredible. Is, it, is that a power button? Yeah, that's right. We can plug in the usba. The usba there. Hmm. Here, I told myself I wasn't gonna buy one of these. I was gonna resign myself to playing with the joy cons at all times. Because I'm, I'm always a proponent of just like not having too much erroneous gear and stuffs just in my life at all times, pretty much any, no matter what I do. But, cursory feel. I'm actually really okay with that. Plug that in. You're charging. You are on the charger. Battery that can last 40 hours on a single charge. Before first use, charge the Pro Controller with the Switch Adapter. The Pro Controller will automatically pair with the Switch Console when it is turned on TV mode and connected to the USB charger cable. 
Well, it appears that we need to start crawling under this desk. Looks like we need to plug this guy into the back of the thing. So, let's, uh, I don't need to turn the mic off. This could just be great for comedy if I will just turn that off. So you can still hear me. Ugh. My old man body. Crawling up there. Oh, I need my, my phone with the battery and the flashlight. And the... Okay. Put that. Let's turn this guy this way. Flip out the back door. This guy needs to go like that. Oh, this is the one. Here, this guy needs to be. Oh, Thundercats. We're on the fucking move. Stupendous. Okay. So with that, we're not going to charge you from here. We're going to unplug you. Now that you're paired, we're going to plug you in here. Instead, where you're charged. Oh. Oh. Hoodle lolly. Boy, we're off to the races. Jesus. What a detour. Boy, just can't get right. I tell you what. So now, with that, the headphones are back on. The headphones are back on. And boom, we turn that off. And we turn this guy back on. And now, feel it. Do you feel it? Enjoy it. Feel it in your chest. We're playing with the pro controller. Now. Like, we went from dead battery to Best Buy to new controller to setup controller and back to gaming less than half an hour. That's what I'm talking about. That's how you do it. And also, this pro controller feels real good. Oh, uh oh. Wait, this is a time trial. That's not great. That's far less than great. Where are you gonna make me climb to? Where? 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 Where am I going? Do I see it? I mean, you should have some kind of an animation that shows me where to go. Oh, down that way? Alright. That we can do. Yaha! -ha. Bye bye. Okay. And of course, now we're gonna like. Well, can we? Now we're a bit too low now. Let's, let's fly back up here. Ooh, armor shop. I didn't even see that. Yo, let's go to the armor shop. Because it's about time that we try and get. Some kind of new armor. We're just kind of on the basic stuff at this point. Man, this controller feels real nice. Man, that feels real nice. Does anybody know if this works for PC? I didn't even do any research before I bought it. I just bought it. Because this would be great to start when I do my randomizer runs for Ocarina of Time. This would feel real good. Yeah. Morning, Light li li Lysa? Lysa, I'm assuming. You're right, we're crazy. Mm -hmm. 
Divine Beast flying up there. This village is in disarray. Really? It looks pretty peaceful from where I'm sitting. Oh, you go bring it down, huh? Aren't you, aren't you, dude? Is there, like, another person below? Oh, there's another hut below. Alright, I guess we'll go down. So... You're the shop. Oh, yeah, with, the, like, the tunic and whatnot right on it. Ooh, are you warm? It is warm. That is cold resistance. 600 rupees, though. Holy crap. Uh, let's just get the doublet. Let's do that, so then, at the very least... We're a little bit warmer. I don't know if that'll still work, but... Um, now the question is... Yeah, let's talk to... Whoever this is? Somebody up there I need to talk to? I don't know. Looks like it. What is this? Oh, this is an inn. Okay, that doesn't help me at all. Okay, we need to go to wherever this beacon is. I think they're down there. They're probably upstairs. Oh, this feels so good. stories. Tell me about it. Awesome, me too. <clears throat> oh, I'm tiny chicken, baby. Once upon a time, my grandpa stopped a big tree while he was climbing a big mountain and looked below him to the northwest. When suddenly he saw a huge snow white birdie with its wings spread wide. My grandpa took off flying after the snow white birdie. And as he got a little closer to the white birdie, Grandpa saw something super important inside its belly. The birdie had swallowed. I always get sleepy around that part, so I don't remember. Well, I know. I know where the big tree is, though. Way the fuck up there. Yeah, we're not going there. A snow white birdie from that tree. What did it swallow? Oh no, Grandpa's gone. Oh, that's sad. Oh, that's sad. Oh, chicken. Okay, so we didn't go all the way up, so whoever we need to talk to must be at the very top of this tree, huh? Uh, yeah, probably that guy. He's... Wait, is this a person? You're not a bird. Good day, Junie. Huh? Yeah, I am. Uh, wandering, trying to find yourself? Yeah, sure. You're on your honeymoon. But this, wow, that's kind of mean, dude. Like, you're a guest. So what, spiritual bird p people are worse than spiritual fish people? Ah. I don't know about this, this girl here. Yeah, that's not true. Oh, wait, this this was a... This was a quest, so... Wow. Holy crap, what a absolute bitch. And I don't have a baked apple, so I'll have to make one eventually. Okay, so you're clearly the guy to talk to. Oh, look at you. You're like a little chicken. You're like the big bird's little brother. 
Or Big Bird. Cool. Before he was Big Bird. Canelli, huh? Cool. Oh my god, he's great. Oh. It is a Sheikah Slate. Forgive me. You're the elder, huh? Yep, you betcha. Oh. <laughs> he's so great. I love how unique and individual all the characters are. Yes, Ravali. Okay, so that's his name. Bob Meadow. Ravali the Master. Barreto. Oh. No, I'm the real dude. Champion, descendant, if you would listen to an old man's request, let's do it. I'm gonna kick my feet up. Tell me a story. Oh, look at you with your little hoot. Hoot, hoot, hoot. Now that, that I have a blood of the champion, you need to ask me something. How to put this? You want me to solve the beast problem? Yeah, I can do that. Champion can stop the divine beast? tried explaining it, but they wouldn't listen. Oh. Tiba and Hearth tried to confront him, but it did not go well, and Hearth was injured. Tiba escaped unscathed, but I fear he now plans to face Meadow alone. As a descendant of the champions, perhaps you can help us. Find Tiba, and find a way to stop him. Sure. Can do. So is this the highest I can go? Let's see if we can get to the top here. Let's see, next we gotta go this way. Because I also saw during the cinematic that there was a, a Korok at the top. Or kind of at the top, that, like an alcove in the middle. So I wanna go talk to him, or shoot him out of the sky. Right quick. Uh, shouldn't you be able to walk here? Uh, I guess not. Yeah, that'll do. Oh, 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 careful now. Which way do we need to go here? Can I only climb to the top of this after I've... No, I guess I can't do that, because I don't get it until after I beat the beast. Oh, this is this looks like such a bad idea. Yeah, I don't see any way around this. Maybe up there? Can I climb up onto that's probably where I need to go. Oh. Or right there works fine, I guess. That makes logical sense to me. How's the pro, pro... Chris, it feels real good. It feels real solid. I should have bought one of these at the beginning. Oh, it's so sturdy. It feels so good to click on its massive... L and R button. Z, L and R? What have you. You get it. There we go. Okay, so now then... We're getting there. Hopefully there's like a shrine or something. Oh, there's our Yahaha. Oh, he's gonna get it. So, can I like let go and stand right here? Nope, sure can't. Let's see. I thought I'd be able to get up there. Maybe I should climb over there. Stand on that rock. And then climb up? Oh boy, hopefully I can still do that. Hopefully there's enough room for me to stand over here. Oh yeah, there definitely is. And then we'll start making the climb up this way. I love a good climbing puzzle. Okay, so there's our Korok balloon. We'll have to shoot that out of the sky. And then we'll figure out how to get to the top of this thing. Because I don't know if there's something worth up there or what, but at the very least... 
Oh wait, hold on. Yeah, ha, ha, bud. All right. I thought I was gonna have to like shoot a couple of balloons, but I'm like, I'll take one. Okay, so yeah, if we can't do anything, if, if there's nothing to do with the top of the spire, at the very least, we can jump off of this large phallic-shaped rock at the top. Yeah, yeah. Because I'm, I'm sure that waypoint is probably for somebody down there, but on the off chance that they're up here. We're gonna do this. Okay, can I stand here? Holy crap, can we not stand here? Oh, I've made a mistake. I've made a mistake. I should probably stop. Yep, sure did. God, it always looks like there's there's enough room to, like, stand and grab onto something, but... Like, this looks like a lip. Maybe I need to go off over here to the left. Like, I should be able to stand there. But I guess it does round off a whole hell of a lot more. careful about it. If I go slow, I can still get there. I hope. I hope. I hope. I hope. Uh, well, like I said, we want to go down. Because the guy that we're probably want to talk to is on the way down. Why aren't you gliding? Oh, because you have no... Well, that's a cool way to die. <laughs> kind of them. Put me right where I need to be. Anyway, like I was saying, like, we just, it's super easy climb, right? So we just need the most direct route to the shortest part. I mean, we were basically there. Like, if I went to back down to the bottom of the mountain and then got that last stamina wheel, like, we already have enough orbs for it. I mean, that's one way to get down from a mountain. Grab onto it slightly and just... Let's see. Ooh, frame rates. Wow, that grass is just like... Was that a problem when the game first came out? I think it was, right? See, this is the entire reason we came down here. I mean, like, this is all planned. Stamina. Yes, please. Well, hopefully this is full charged. Let's unplug this. Wow. That really just sticks in there. Okay. Now with that, we can definitely make it to the top when we want to make it to the when it's the plan to make it to the top. guys relaxing. Okay, so right here, maybe in that hut? If not, they're on the top. Let's find out. Okay. I still want to see what's at the top of that thing. 
Even if there's no save for it or anything. Any travel for it. Oh, I mean, you're clearly Tiva. The most unique sprite here. Hello! Uh. No, you're Saki. Oh, Tiva's your husband. Oh, so you're just gonna give me directions. Okay, where'd he go? Husband headed to the flight range. It's in Dronox Pass at the base of the Hebra Mountains. It's a place where Rita warriors prepare for aerial combat. Okay, so he's gonna make... Okay. Oh, it's in that direction. So Rivali's landing. Shoot. It's a straight shot down to the flight range. Huh. Okay, so, yeah. Oh, remember, remembering something? Impressive, I know. Very few can achieve a mastery of the sky. Yet I have made an art of creating an updraft that allows me to soar. It's considered to be quite the masterpiece of aerial techniques, even among the Rito. With proper utilization of my superior skills, I see no reason why we couldn't easily dispense with Ganon. Now then, my ability to explore the firmament is certainly of note. But let's not, pardon me for being so blunt, let's not forget the fact that I am the most skilled archer of all the Rito. Yet despite these truths, it seems that I have been tapped to merely assist you. All because you happen to have that little darkness ceiling sword on your back. I mean, it's just asinine. Unless you think you can prove me wrong, maybe we should just settle this one on one. But where? Oh, I know. How about up there? Oh, you must pardon me. I forgot you have no way of making it up to that divine beast on your own. Good luck sealing the darkness! Yeah, Rivali's kind of a little shit. Huh? What a jerk. <laughs> At the same time, though, that's probably the best voice acting we've heard yet. So... He's an asshole, but he's a convincing asshole. I approve of it. Am I alright? I'm okay. So is that hair, or is those feathers? Yeah, so how do feathers curl like? Huh. Okay, so. Oh, shit. Flashlight's been on the whole time. Turn all that crap off. Alright, let's see here. Wait, so we need to go that way. So we need to go from Rivali's Landing. No, you're not Rivali's Landing. Wait, and you said it was a... Is this the landing? You said go that way. Do I have the wrong thing on? Oh. Well, that's really fucking convenient. Seeing as how we already went there. Alright, we'll just walk over. A leisurely stroll. Should be easy enough. So you know what we should do? We should go over to here. 
pull through this up here. And then here. Go into there. Hold on. Multiple things at one time. Am I still cold? Did I need to purchase the whole set to not be cold? Ugh. Hold on, we're going back. I guess we're buying the entire set. This guy. And the Explore. And boo. There we go. Now, we need to go this side, and then there. Haha! -ha. So now, part one of this video is already exported. Okay, so we need the entire... We need the entire outfit for this, right? So, let's not do that. Let's go over here. Okay, so we need... Let's just buy the whole thing. I'm, I'm not looking to sell here. Can I buy your pants? I'm not going to be able to buy the whole thing. Okay, let's... Man, that sucks. Okay, but that's enough. That's enough that we won't be cold out there. And now we can go to cold places. So that works. So if we wanted to, we could go off the tutorial island and go to that one tower that was just to the southwest that was in the snow area, the snowy desert area. Get that map. If possible. I want to get the map just completely cleared out as fast as possible. Oh. Okay. So I'm going to have to fly and I have to shoot at the same time. This sounds terrible. Hopefully they give me arrows, because if not, I will waste all of mine. Almost without a doubt, but as I say it, oh, that's a pretty shitty bow. I'll leave that. So, what about this guy? Is he a dick? Yeah. Yeah. I'm real. I'm Tiba. I don't know you. And I'm actually pretty busy here. You should probably go. And? That's it? So, where do I have to go to shoot all these targets? Should I shoot them now? Will you pay attention to me if I shoot one? Well, let's see. Break this one. Break that one. Break. Go over here. Oh, well, that really took out my stamina really fast. What if I talk to you now? Hmm. Oh, I just had to talk to him again? You know, I don't blame him for this, though. Some random dude just shows up and like, I'm gonna help you. <laughs> I'm Link. Hmm. Link is T, but T was Link. I knew that already. Yup. That's right. I'm here to help. You're not going anywhere. As a Rita warrior, I can't, can't rest until my people are safe. That makes sense. Hmm. 
And you're only going back once I've beaten the thing, huh? You're gonna you're gonna kill a big robotic bird. I don't think so, dude. <laughs> yeah, well, you're wrong about that, bud. I'm right here. Huh. Cannons, huh? Use an updraft. This ravine to hone our aerial archery skill. The updrafts are so strong that they can. That a person can just open a, a cloth over their head and can't use it. Okay, so we need five targets. Five targets. Are you gonna move them? Nope, it sure is. Why aren't why aren't you climbing? Do I have to go all the way to the top? Well, why doesn't Okay, maybe I should have asked him for pointers. Like, why can't I, I shoot after... Hmm. Hold on. Any pointers? Huh. That doesn't help me. Why couldn't I... Why can't I shoot again after I open my sailcloth a second time? Well, whatever. I guess we're just going to have to do it all in one go, I guess. Okay, so there's one, two... Oh, we'll find out. Like... It won't shoot. Oh, did I break a bow? Hold on. Yep, sure did. See, I hate that. I want them to just re-equip a bow if I run out. Like, that's so ridiculous. Hmm. Huh. That's probably my least favorite thing in the game. Did, did it even tell me that my bow broke? I didn't see... If, I, if it did, I didn't... I didn't see it. Maybe it did. Okay, now that... Now that we can... Honestly, if you're going to make me do that, you should just give me arrows for free. Like, not make me waste all of mine. Okay. So you got to tell me you didn't think I was someone that could, get, that could do it, but now you know I can. Yep, I've seen huh. hundreds of them. Hundreds of them. Okay, well, let's do it. I'll get you in position and you can give its cannons all you've got. Hmm. If that treasure chest is a bow I've modified, take it. But I don't have arrows, dude. Like, 
And that falcon bow is still worse than what I have. Shit. Because now I'm completely out of arrows. And you're not going to give me any. Well, okay, how are we going to do this? Do you have... Well, there is a general store, so let's go there. We'll go to the general store. We'll see if there's arrows. If there's arrows, we'll buy arrows. And once we've bought arrows, then we'll go. But before we buy arrows... This beer is broke. I'm gonna go get me a new one. Alright? So I'll be back in two shakes of lamb's tail. We'll get back to getting arrows and whatnot, alright? Just when you think you're out of IPAs, and then there's one more IPA sitting in the back, laying on side, all side goggled and whatnot. Oh, ain't no loggers for me. We got the good stuff. We got the good stuff. Mm, mm. Yeah. <sighs> all right. So with that, general store. Wait, yeah, general store. Uh, probably that guy. Don't need that. So this has to be it, right? Okay, do you have arrows? Holy crap, you have all kinds of... I don't have money, though. Okay, bundles of five. How many do you have? Three? I'm gonna have to. God, this town has cleaned me out. What is that? Goat butter? Sugar cane. Tabantha wheat. That's weird. Diary. Ooh. So all those things. With an apple. Interesting. Huh. Anyway. That's probably not helpful information, so let's do the thing. Let's go beat a fucking beast. And then we can get this special whatchamacallits and we can float through the sky and we can traverse Hyrule even faster. Which is everything I want right now. I want to be able to float like a bumblebee and sting like a bumblebee. We want to do everything that bumblebees do. As we sting and we poke and we bumblebee. Let's see. I can just ride that updraft up to him. Let's see. Not only that, but like taking down another beast would give us another heart container, which is much easier. I just went to the store. I just went to the store. Well, granted, I didn't have enough money for it anyway. Oh, well... I'm, I'm 
ready. I got run close. Hmm. What do I care most about? Zelda? I honestly care more about the bird people. Hmm. Every single beast, we gotta be surfing on somebody. And honestly, I'm not mad about it. I'm not mad. Holy crap. Huh. Oh, and like, draw distance is still up. Like, you can see it, right? Alright, showtime. Yo, you got a goddamn shield? Hmm. Okay, so you gotta draw the fire. And then just roll the cannons, huh? So then, I just need to find an updraft and float up, and he'll come get me. Huh. Yeah, I'm fine. Don't worry about it. All right, let's do it. Let's do the damn thing. Actually, go for it. Sweet fight, though. Got it. Okay. Let's get over him. This is pretty intense.
like I got hit pretty good back there. I think... I think I need to get back to the flight range. I just hope that I can make it back. You head down to Meadow. Good luck. It's all you. Yeah, see, now that's a cool character. I'm, I'm down with Tiba. Much better than Revalia. I, I want Tiba's grace after all this is over. That's what I want. But that was a pretty great fight. That was that was much more fun than the Bamuda fight. Okay, so. And the thing. Now we can fast travel to him. Well now, I've seen that face before. I had a feeling you would show up eventually, but making me wait a hundred years is a bit indulgent. You're here to wrest control of Meadow away from Ganon, correct? If so, then the first thing you'll want to do is find yourself a map. Okay. So up in his brain is where the map is. They're all much more interesting. Than... Good. I'm glad Val Valruda was the was the low point. That so now everything stone gonna... has the information for the layout of this yeah. divine beast. Can you make it there? A dick. Well, good thing Valruda was the was the low point. Was the low point of everything. So now I can appreciate everything else. Parking my shots for too long and I just overcompensate now. Have arrows in you, please. Have a whole bushel of arrows. Those aren't arrows. Hopefully somewhere in here there are arrows. Let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's get this guy down. bit better on this. Okay, so you're just over there? Never one for turning away a... Uh... <laughs> turning away a free chest. See, that's good. That's what we want. Okay, so... Ooh, geez, like a... Big glassy ribcage on this guy. Let's see, where's your eyeball? I'm not even gonna... I'm not gonna even gonna waste an arrow on you. Alright, that would just be a waste. Ancient shaft, a shaft, I got shafted, and that's it. It's probably outside. Definitely need to make sure I have enough chests. How far does this take me? Okay. So, was there an opening on the other side? I can't remember. Like, is there a way for me to sail into his head from here? That would be real helpful, but I don't think so. Oh, Alright, so I guess I have to time it here. Try and sail across. Either that or figure out a puzzle or some shit. Who wants to do that? I can 
just have enough to get to here. We get a chest, and then we can just sail over to the other side. Easy peasy. Don't even need to mess with whatever this is. It's clearly all of this is on tracks. And I'm gonna have to rearrange all of this somehow for some reason. I think. Don't mind me, dude. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Hold on. God damn it. Here. God, why can't I just have things equipped? Why can't you just auto equipped? I will tell you when I don't want things equipped. Give me my damn map. Give me my damn map. Okay, this is what, like, this has got to be like to iOS, like, 3.4 or something already. Okay, so what are those? Terminals? Okay, tilt? What do you mean, tilt? Are you kidding? I have to tilt it on its side? You'll need to look closely at your map of the Divine Beast. Yeah. The terminals that will activate Meadow are marked by those glowing points. You'll need to activate all of the terminals to take back control. Okay. Think you're up to it. Yes. Okay. So, looks like there's more terminals on the right. So, this is how we're supposed to do this, right? Like, we're supposed to... Oh, but that's all broken. I can't get that way. Oh, and I should have hit that guy when I was up there. Oh, whatever. So, you're not even on a track. So, you are... Um, so, you're gonna do this... And I wanna go... Wait. Oh, am I facing the back? This way. So if I want to go that way, I want to go down here, like this. If I do that, is it? Okay. So clearly I have to move something across there after these guys are spinning. I'm assuming that gate opens. And then this guy, like, flies into that thing and opens something. What does this do? First of all, first of all. God. My sense of rage now is just completely bad. And then with that, we do one of those. That's still spinning as long as the air current doesn't move. Oh, but wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Damn it. Did it just move enough? Okay, so I need to, like, break it at the correct time. Well, let's just try it going one time all the way out. All the way Maybe I don't have to stasis it at all. Let it go all the way back. And then I'll go this way. Maybe this guy won't move. Ah, hell you know what, we're just gonna do it anyway. Oh. That worked fine.
hora não é fazer isso. Ok. Esse There are four terminals remaining. Still a ways to go. God, this guy is just a this guy. Oh, that didn't even open it. This just opened it. This just broke the shit. Hmm. Oh, more arrows. You beautiful bastard. Okay, so now that we know that. Do we have to close this? <laughs> or that has to open up somewhere else. I don't see any other... I don't see any other way to do that. Can I climb this? That doesn't appear so. No idea how we get to that chest. So Could that have like taken me on an updraft all the way over? At the very least, that could get me to over here. Which could then get us in there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Now let's shoot this guy now that we see him. There are three terminals remaining. Keep going. Roger that. Okay, so... How do you... Well, that's, that's pretty clear-cut right there. And now how do I... How is this going to work? Flip it the opposite direction. And then you just roll right into it. And that will open that. I'm so good. So great. So great. So good. go over here. Grab this and get in here. 
She there are two terminals remaining. There are two. You're almost there. God. So patronizing. Okay, so now, how are we gonna get over there? Is a good question. Is there enough of an angle for me to just jump off of here and get it? Inclines here aren't your thing, I guess. But... Okay, so now that I'm here, back to this. Like, I don't know if this is enough to get there. I guess we'll have to think. Can I have... Oh, get out of here. I didn't even realize that. <laughs> Oh, you can... God, that's kind of hard to, like, judge the angle that you're at. Look under the wings. Under which wings? Under the under the entire bird's wings? Can I go... Can I go... Okay, hold on. It's a level of mile. One of them is down farther, but I don't think I can get there too, right? So I need to go down here. Yeah, so there's that guy there. Oh, shut up. I don't want to do that. Let's go this way. I just automatically spawn out 100% well. It is bound to happen. Okay, so now, what was that? to drop down from the top. Right? Well, let's look over here first. Also, only two arrows? Oh! Uh, so I want to go that way. this guy just one terminal remaining <laughs> what do you know god just the worst just just scathing with contempt this guy So, with 
this, now that I know... Oh, I can't. Like, well, I can't, but... Oh, whatever. I can get there regardless. Oh, wait, what am I doing? That's not the easiest way to do it. We know that we can't get there from here. The only reasonable explanation is that we come from the top. So we are going out that way. Or we can just go up this way. Up this way. Up this way. Okay, so. Let's actually not be on an angle. Okay, so we got. jump off and float down through the front door. That sounds dangerous. But then again, I don't see an Well, let's do one for science, huh? Yeah. Oh. Wait. I could have just put it at an angle. And just sailed clean through. Good. Fuck me. Anyway. Science still worked. Multiple directions. That was the last terminal. Now you just need to start the main control unit. I want you to take a good look at your map. There should be a new glowing point on there. Well, flap to it. Oh, okay, so we need to go... Let me go down. There's, there's no way out, right? Yeah, 100%. 100%. We were just supposed to do one of these. Wow. Occam's razor, people. It's a thing. Simplest solution. out of curiosity. Do we need to take a picture of the blight cannon? Is that a thing? Let's find out. If you need to take each one of the blights, I'm gonna be angry. thing is one of Ganon's own, and it plays dirty. It defeated me 100 years ago, but only because I was winging it. I can't believe I'm actually saying this, but you must avenge me, Link! His aim is dead on. Watch yourself! I did need to get the other Blight! Damn it! Oh, this is 
so can we, like, not uh, use that? Oh, you're way up there. That's the last one, right? Well, we're gonna move away from you. Okay, so healing stasis then. As it appears so, so what I want to do, since I have bomb arrows, I'm going to bomb your face. Come on, come on. That was partly... Partly my own videos. I was partly trying to do destiny things. Can we stay in the thing? I can't stay in the thing. Alright, what do we got? Well, let's first start with the dubious foods. That gets eight. We don't want to do that. Hasty. I don't really want to do that either. Guess we'll do a sneaky fish. Crap. See, this is what I'm talking about. If I run out of a bow, give me a new bow. Like, don't make me sit here and like, why can't I shoot him? Phase two. Right, phase two. Are you serious? Watch your blind spot. Now's your chance. God, I like I run out of all stamina when I'm over there. I need to like drop the well see that's not fair. This is gonna ragdoll off the side of the stage and then fly back up. Yeah, budgeting the stamina and like... That was the difficult part of the fight. Budgeting stamina. And arrows.
All right. In a heart container. All right. Slowly but surely, we're getting stronger, people. And of course, we're gonna have to go to another. Darn, do you wish to activate it? Sure do. I'll be plucked. You defeated him, eh? Who would have thought? Well done. I suppose I should thank you now that my spirit is free. This returns Meadow back to its rightful owner. <laughs> Don't preen yourself just for doing your job. I do suppose you've proven your value as a warrior. A warrior worthy of my unique ability. The sacred skill that I have dubbed Ravali's Gale! It's now time to move on and start making preparations for Meadow Strike on Ganon. But only if you think you'll still need my help while you're fighting inside Hyrule Castle. Feel free to thank me now. Or, never mind, just go. Your job is far from finished, you know. The princess has been waiting an awfully long time. No. Yeah, she has. She'd be waiting a whole hell of a lot less time if you stopped talking, bud. Oh, jeez. All right. Back again. Sights are now set. You'll have a precise speed on Ganon from this vantage point. And when the time is right, give him everything you've got. Now we wait for that perfect moment. <laughs> Meadow, we've been artfully patient for the last 100 years. I doubt you'll suffer a feather over a few more moments. After all these years, I simply must admit the truth. Even without the power of flight, Link made his way to this divine beast and accomplished something that even I could not. Guess I was wrong about how lucky he would be. I hope that luck holds out, Link, for everyone's sake. All right, two beasts down. Ravali's <laughs> Gale, Buster's power that creates an upward draft. 
activate it by charging by charging jump with X. Charging a jump, charging jump. Hmm. Okay, well now that we've done that, where do we even go? Let's see. I think we should try and get some maps. Let's see, we only have a couple more towers to get. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, I'm putting my money on it. Hold on, what's this? Ooh. I have to do that. So let's go back to this. This is this is the, the snowy, cold tutorial shrine that's closest to the tower on this southwestern side. Let's see if we can Ravali's Gale and sail over, now that we have warm clothing, and see if we can't uh, ascend this tower. Because if we can start getting the map, just figured out. Like, I'll feel much better about it. Let's see, so Ganon's that way, so we need to look this way. And it's pretty close. Ooh, and there's a shrine right there. But what's the fastest way to do this? Fastest way to get there. Probably go sail down to there without Rivali's Gale. Rivali's Gale across over to there and then climb up, is my guess. So let's try it. We can go down and get that guy if we want. After we get that. Ooh, there's like a whole system of stuff over here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Needless grace is ready. Or do I try and take the bridge? If I take the bridge, where would that take me? Oh, well, there is a clear way over. Might have to fight some guys, but... Oh uh, wait, what? What? Oh, I don't need to. I don't need to face you yet. That's all right. Oh crap! Can I still get up there? I sure can. Oh, there's the bridge. Ooh, and there's a yahaha right there. Are you gonna chase me? How far are you gonna chase me, bud? Will you, will you chase me over here? No, of course you won't. Let's see how we do this here. We probably, if we just climb high enough, let go. Let go, glide. Nope, not like that. Wait, what's that? Actually, let's test. Huh. Yeah, all right. Well, that's much easier. Yeah. Hundred percent. That was the right move. That's exactly what we should have done. This is gonna make getting around Hyrule to getting off our spots much easier.
Bless me. Alright. That's pretty necessary. We are, like, really strapped for cash at the moment. We need to start replenishing all of our stock on things before we start hitting a new area. Or else we're going to be in some real trouble. Maybe if we need some fire-resistant clothes or some kind of clothes and can't buy anything. No. Ladder. Ladder. There you go. I'm kind of surprised that they don't have, like, any bacoblins or anything. Like... Bacoblins or moblins or anybody, like, guarding these... Little areas? Like, it seemed like something that would be kind of important. Or maybe I'm just gonna, like, gonna walk up this little ramp and... Turn around and there's gonna be an army of them and... I'm gonna aggro every single one of them. They're gonna come at me and just throw their... Boko clubs at me. Nope, definitely not that. Huh. Interesting. Oh, Alright. And then how long does it take... Do I have to use all three of Ravali's Gales before they start respawning? Tons of jewels to be mined near the volcano. Oh, okay. So maybe it is time to... Well, we'll we're by default going to the Goron village anyway. Okay, there's bad guys. Wait, was that for pulling the chest out or for mashing the seed? Did I do both at the same time? I must have, right? Yes, ice arrows. Good. Are there, like, a couple here? Like, what's this guy doing? Oh, wait. Very, 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 very... Oh, you're an electron. You're an electron. That would have been great if that worked. That's why I probably shouldn't go up this way. I might not get more... Uh, I probably have to use all three of my, my Gale Jumps in order to have them respawn. Or start respawning, but I really don't want to waste them if I don't have to. Also, it seems like there's bad guys here. Oh, crap, is there? It's just fine. It's just fine. Nobody was here. You were just hearing things. Let's move slowly. Let's see. So are all the enemies up here? On this level? Is it all defended? This area doesn't seem to be. Just over there. Uh, here's what we're gonna do about this, though. Uh, this is like, it'll be just enough. Let me just jump up here. Gotta mine those jewels. I'll get to it. I'll get to it. Don't, don't worry about it. Don't rush me. Honestly, I don't want to waste my weapons, like... I don't feel like I'm well-equipped for where I am in the game. Oh, shit. Well, you know what? Oh, Jesus! Come on, dude! Okay, hold on. If you guys are just gonna be jerks about it... Oh, that bomb did nothing to you! Oh, but that did everything to me!
Yeah, see, this is what I'm talking about. I fight guys, and they murder me real quick. I try and hit them, I do literally no damage. This is why I don't want to waste my things. Like, I feel like I'm not well equipped. I feel like I can't really do... Like, even in the... I guess I should probably mark these. Seeing how I see them. Oh! There is a camel. That's 100% a camel. Okay, so this is where we're going to use the rest of our Revali scales. Yep, 100%. And that's how you do it. Also, we should eat some raw foods. Just a few. Do I have anything that, like, can fill up a little bit more? Yeah, hearty radishes, that's good. That'll do. So, like, my question is, when do they start ramping up the... The, the damage values on the weapons that you get. Are they randomly generated? Are they... Are they... Locked in from the start? Like, if I go to a really hard shrine and beat it, will I get... A better weapon than... You know, something that's closer to the tutorial area? Like, is it by how many hearts I have? How many... How many dudes I beat? Like, where... Where's the line here? why we have yep. That's a hundred percent why we have Revali's Gale. Solid. Clearly there was a puzzle down there that I need to use with the uh, metal crates, but I ain't having it. I'm not having it, I'm not. Oh, hi, Mar. So is that... So is that the Gerudo village down there? That square area, or... Is that something else? Alright, iPad 4.1. 4.0.1 God, that's a big chunk of that. Oh, it's sexy how big it is. Ooh, what's that? Ooh, that's a maze. Oh, there's all kinds of weird stuff on this map. Huh. Alright. Okay. Yeah. Okay, that's gotta be the Gerudo village. The fact that there's a shrine, like, right out front. Like, that's gotta be it, right? Look at our camel friend. He's a camel. He's got a weird head, though. It's mostly neck and less head. Huh. Alright. Hold on one second. I'll be back in less than a minute. I'm gonna go to the bathroom real quick, alright?
Oh, righty then. And we're back. And we're back. There it is. Okay, so. Where to go first? I mean, now that we have this, we can kind of sail up and then fast travel and come back kind of to our heart's content here. So there's one that's down there. Got the one on the other side. Got this view, though. This beautiful. Just, you're, you're beautiful. Okay. So I'm going to make the executive decision that we're going down here. going to do our yaha -ha. Oh, oh, careful now. Let's see. So, it looks like... No. Bad link. Yep. That this guy needs to go here on this one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yaha. Okay. And now that we've got that guy... We can climb over here. And sail down to the guy that was just underneath us. Let's see. Like right over there. So we'll try and land on that land bridge first. Hopefully there's nobody that's gonna knock me out. Like, are these supposed to be enemy like scaffolds and whatnot, or this is this Gerudo stuff, or Gerudo? If you're one of the lunatics that say Gerudo instead of Gerudo. Oh, this is a stable. Lovely. K no. K. No. No. K. All right. Okay. But no. Master Sword is in the forest area in the center of the map. Okay. Take time to gather jewels to make money so that you can make the best armor and weapons. Yeah, I, I've been to the tech lab. I still need to go get the blue fire for that thing. That's what I need to do. I visited. I did visit, Christopher. I am familiar with Robe, the robot whisperer. So, yeah, I'll have to do that too. Might not be tonight, especially. Let's see. Power of electricity. Okay, so a little bit of a. This is how you electricity. Damaged. Let's use this guy. You don't die too quick. Out of here, Christopher. Goodbye, my friend. Thanks for hanging out, bud. Like it's nice to have you in here talking to me. One of these things I'm gonna have to do our uh, our Mario night. We're gonna do our Mario Kart night. One of these days. Whenever you have some free time and I have some free time and we feel like having a couple of beers and going fast. We'll have to do that. So, 
All right, bud. Well, you have a good night, and I'll talk to you next time. All right. So was this a big thing of electricity? Is this like the thing of fire that we did before? Oh, we got keys. Let's see. Oh, there was a door the whole time. Is this a big guy or a small guy? Do we have enough to maybe get another part from here tonight? No, not at all. We need two. Now, let's see. At the very least, we can fly back up to the top. And once we're back up to the top, we can fly down to the... the uh, shrine that we passed on the way in. So we do this. There's got to be a lot down in here, and some in here that we missed. There's obviously going to be stuff up in here. We definitely know that there's some here that we missed. Huh. All this stuff, hold on. That's weird. Alright. Um... Yeah, so let's go back up here, and then let's fly down and get that one shrine. Oh, ouch. And then we'll go for like another 20 minutes. Oh, to make up for the half an hour that we went out and grabbed the controller real quick. This was a pretty successful couple episodes. Let's see, north is that way. So we're looking down there. That's where we want to go. Uh, there's probably one right there, because that looks like the shape of the shrine just by itself. It seems fairly... I wonder if we can get to this guy. Now that we have Rivali's Gale. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see. We 
should have marked this guy before we flew across. So we know exactly where he is. Was it on that side? Was it all the way over there? No, it's right here. And fire boy. Mm. <laughs> we are gonna kill this guy. Oh, is that it? Did we kill him? And this is the entire reason we just did that. Um, what can we throw out? Oh, I probably could just use the flame bow, I suppose, but... Wow, you are actually the worst thing we have. I absolutely want that fire rod, though. Because with it, then we can... Like, if we don't have any fire arrows, then we can actually set something on fire. Which is kind of important. Okay, I see wolves, but nothing else. Just, oh, we should do this real quick. Saw for a second. Got it. Don't go anywhere. You gotta go. No. No. Oh. No. Right there. Yeah, ha ha, dude. Man, the next time we see Hestu, we're gonna get all kinds of shit. G, but like K, but like no G, but no. Okay. Actually, I should probably do the ball. And then... Oh, man. Oh. Well, that sucks. find some arrows somewhere here. Real bad about it. Are you kidding? I'm not gonna have enough arrows to do all this.
When you guys are just gonna move. There's one more. Please have arrows. Please for the love of God. Have arrows. You son of a bitch. Alright, well. Well, if I didn't do that...
Now that I know that that's the mechanic. Always check behind him for a check. So we need four more hearts in order to get the Master Sword. Shit. So we could trade up two of our stamina. Three stamina. Hmm. So if we do that, we'd have 12. We'd only need to get one more. Right? We go back to the Gargoyle, we get three of our stamina things for three hearts, we'll be up to twelve, we'll get one more, we can go get the Master Sword after we get the Master Sword. Can we go back to less than thirteen hearts? Or do we just need thirteen hearts to get it? Uh, we'll find out. Because that would be the way to do it. Let's see. Uh -huh. There is a guy. How far are you? Yeah, you're kind of on the way. What else can we see from here? Anybody else? We got a bear. Went down there. I think I want to do like one more thing before we call it quits, but what is the question? Now if we can get to there. And that looks like it should be a pretty simple walk. Looks like is the operative term. Let's just do it. Take this thing. We might be able to go over there and wrap up that line. Let's see how the shrine plays out. We either stop at the shrine or we'll stop at the tower. We're in a temple tower. Hmm. Are you kidding me? Right there? Of all the places. For there to be one enemy on this mountain. Right, this looks like a very conspicuous coral. Maybe not, maybe it's just troubles. Looks like there's a Korok thing way up at the top there. Korok race. Yeah, Korok 
over here as well. And over there. God, there's like a whole nest of Koroks in this little valley. Huh. I wonder if this area is important for some reason. You know, come over here. We need the stone. Where is this done? Right here. There we go. Move over to here. Drop it. Yeah. Found you, bud. Okay. I'm gonna do that one too if I really wanted. I don't think I have the patience for that right now. Honestly, we'd rather get to the tower. I just kind of remember that there's one I can do for So we've got 25 of the 999 Koroks. 30 of 120, so we're 25% on shrines. That's pretty good. Now the door's open the way. No fucking kidding. Seems kind of ridiculous. Like, why wouldn't you just spawn it? As opposed to magnificing it. Because with this, we can take it off. Just back here. Attack up plus four. That's kind of weird. So did I like accidentally step into like a earlier area?
only hit me, but that still did exactly what I wanted it to. So we're up to three. If we get one more, we'll have everything we could need to get a Master Sword. But we probably won't do that. Well, maybe we would. Who knows? So let's... 10.35. Problem is it starts to get pretty late. And I don't want to be too disruptive to my roommate here. Get to that tower, how long would it take? Okay, let's give it one try. Let's give it one college try here to get up to that. Let's try and get up to the tower. If we get up to the tower, we'll call it night. If we can't, we'll still call it night. We'll just work back to something. when it gets hot in here. Interesting. So we're like entering a rainforest. Oh, I see. 
that a dragon? That is a dragon over there. Is that just Farosh? It's gotta be Farosh, because they wouldn't put Nehru so close. Oh yeah, 100%. He just like dives into the water like no big deal. Okay, all right. Let's see any sign of shrines? Yeah, I don't see anything. Okay, all right. Oh right, wait. I right passed one. Just way over there. Go ahead and do this then. Okay then, and with that, ooh. Oh, maybe you're like supposed to come up here and sail over. Man, they're really into those those star fruits or whatever. Weird. Yeah, anyway. Look at that fucking dragon. Alright, chat, with that, that's it for this evening. We took a little break, but we still managed to hit our, our typical four-plus hours. So we'll call that for here. Um, we might be back with more Zelda tomorrow. Or I might go do Zelda Random Runs tomorrow. And instead, do a, a little bit of Breath of the Wild on Monday. I just don't know which yet. So, follow on Twitter. Keep an eye on that stuff. Because that's where, uh, that's where I make plans, and that's where I tell people. So, check that out. If not, we'll see you the next time. We'll be doing more uh, composing streams th this next week, and we'll do more Breath of the Wild. You know, chipping away at it. And, yeah, that's it for now. So, have fun. We'll see you later. And we'll see you next time. All right. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.